Alright, what's up? It's your boy ZB. I'm here with the main man of Mini Clip himself, Call Me Menemy, aka Pets from Monchi. Good to have you with us, mate. Good to be here in my own room. And you know, <laughs> um, now we've got some questions here from uh, you know the members of the community and um, you know people who just wanted to know some answers to some questions. I hope you're down with answering some. Yeah, you know? sure. It covers everything really that the members want to know. Uh, so we'll get right on with it just now. First question, Colm, um, what do you think the future for the Miniclip forums are? Um, well, obviously I see the forums continuing to grow as they have done for the last year. As you all know, doubling its size in the last couple of months, more or less. Last couple of months. <laughs> it's all the old people come back, man, yeah. I gotta say. Legends, yeah. So, yeah, hopefully that will continue and who knows, we could have 3 million posts by 2011. Uh, four, um, 4 million posts by 2012 or 20 million posts by two, 2 million number, number one on big boards number one, that's what that's we're going for 100% that's, yeah. that's, all, that's what it's about um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, only big boards matters that's all there we go, that's the main uh, also hopefully soon in the future we can get these rules, concerns out of the way and sorted out and Absolutely. you can all enjoy the forum better and you can enjoy the forum better and exactly. I'll still find something to moan about. I don't have what. to listen to complaints all the time. Exactly, exactly. I've seen the amount of emails this man gets, the fact he puts up with it, he is a saint. One, 100 mini clip emails a month, Yeah, honestly. And about 50 of them are from the same person, you know who you are. Okay, we're going to move on. Um, okay, now this is something I personally like to know, as obviously I'm an advocate of change and you know, an overall legend, but you know, uh, Colin, do you like the idea, you know, of giving members more freedom and relaxing the forums, you know? No. No! <laughs> I'm just kidding. I saw that. Um, relaxing the forums, yeah, it's good, but we have to do it in a way that doesn't upset the people upstairs, the bosses. Yeah, exactly. You, it's treading on eggshells, uh, you know what I mean? I mean, the thing is, you know, I'm admin, but the main kind of rules, you know, they aren't set by me, they're set by the employees and stuff and you know I can only edit the rules and relax them. There we go, you can't shoot the messenger. You yeah know I mean, mean just, just like a line we can cross before we're breaking their policy. It's a so, blue line on the ground, it's a literal line they have yeah. where you can't go over it you know that's always kill. I mean you, you as I said you can't shoot the messenger, He's you're essentially you know the team yeah. boy on a movie set you know. Yeah I mean I, I, would, <laughs> I would try to relax the rules and you know take away unnecessary ones so that we have as much freedom as possible but you know, we're never, I don't think we're ever going to get it quite as, as relaxed as everyone wants. Uh -huh. Just because I don't have the authority to do that and I don't think the people, but you know, I still, they're being, they're being pretty reasonable. I mean, the rules, the policy, they are, they're not like draconian evil policies. Exactly. Like, you know, we'll, we'll, still, we'll still be fun for them, however. Well, however we, we choose yeah. to do it. Alright, now this is a question that I myself again want to know as well as many of the members, new members, old members, uh, people who have been here a while and have seen seen the filter change, you know, why can't you just take some of the words out of the filter, why can't you, you know, some of the lesser words like crap and LMAO, it seems a bit ridiculous. Personally, I've got, you know, nearly all my infractions of which I have many are for swearing when I haven't actually meant to swear, I mean I do swear a lot, but you know, I mean in terms of half the time I've not even been, I've just been laughing at something and I've got an infraction for it, you know, that that's going to happen to a lot of people, it's going to grind their gears, you know? Well, simple answer is, these words are in the filter because Miniclip policy says they have to be. The policy, you know, regarding these words is that Miniclip is a, a family-friendly website, they don't want swearing and they're, you know, they're kind of reluctant to take it out. I mean, I, I, can, see, I can see the logic in that. If, if they want that kind of website with that kind of tone, mm -hmm. then you can't have these words. Yeah, it's, it's kind of unfortunate for, you know, some of you guys. You can't say these, but... Because we, words like crap, myself and like Felicia use as a workaround to other words that mm -hmm. I probably can't say because they'll try and filter this as well, you know what I mean? Yeah. But, you know, when the workaround is censored, I reckon that's when you think you've got an issue because it's too strict, do you know what I mean? Do you reckon what we're going to see, I mean obviously we're, but there's been will, a campaign will, for change, you know? Will, will we see words lifted from the filter? Yeah, that's what we want to know. Come on, I, commit, I, commit, I, yes I have, or no? I have yes or no? Next. Yes or no? No. <laughs> oh, 
I, no. I have next to no power whatsoever over the filter because I don't decide any clip policy, therefore I don't decide that these words are allowed or not. Uh, I know, terrible, man. There might be scope for one or two tiny words being removed. Maybe, tiny maybe, words. Maybe, maybe What about a few four letter words? Maybe we can remove Ass or laugh my ass. No, ass isn't ass. Isn't, ass, ass isn't ass. actually, but LMAO yeah. is. Well, That's we could hypocrisy, man. Could maybe remove LMAO, maybe. Ma but, it, but it shouldn't even be there, man. It's I know. Ridiculous, man. Well, bench frustration at miniclip. <laughs> I, I do have my frustration at miniclip, but unfortunately, I you just need to watch the uncensored version for that. <clears throat> now, uh, as you know. Well, as you should know, for the last couple of years, uh, this might be an alien concept to people who joined in 2010, but the last couple of years, 2008, 2009, we've been running, my man here's been running rather, the minis end of year competition, that's correct, yeah, two that's years. That's correct, minis has been going on for two years now, although we have had member of the year since 2005, just minus all the other, comp all the other awards and the Player Channel Awards as we all that we don't exist. Nah. I, I don't personally use the player's channel. I think it's something I need to do. Is it what, do you reckon it's worth setting up an account? Definitely. And if you take and if you set up an account and you win a minis, one of the main minis uh, competitions, you will get a mini statuette for your player channel. There we go. That's what to do. A virtual statuette that you actually physically can't touch. I know. If I won that, that's, that's well, my life completely. Only winnable well. on the forum in December. Exactly. You come in November, you just get chucked away at the door. Yeah. You come in January, no one knows what you're talking about. That's what you got to do. You got to know your months. That's why. That's why you go to school, kids. Uh, anyway, so, <laughs> so, so the plans for this year's minis. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I was, uh, I, so I'm a terrible host, man. I just ramble, man. Um, plans for this year's minis. Plans for. Yeah. Have you got anything planned? Anything uh, different? Yeah, really, it's something really big this time. For the, for the first year ever, I'm going to try and film the minis. In Oscar style, that means that means red. That's what it does. No, it's going to actually be hosted, li not live, but live. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wish. Like, I wish. I, like, like feed on, feed onto YouTube or something. <laughs> I'd be so sick, man. Seriously. Maybe, 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 maybe 2011. Yeah, two thousand. That's look out for that 2011. But 2010, we got small baby steps. You know what I mean? Aye. So th I'm gonna. I'm not gonna lie. That actually sounds, you know, really good, and I'm. Like Revolte, I'm a big style skeptic, you dig? So, you know, it takes a lot to get, but I think that'll be good. But, you know, I can't help but notice, you know, if you're presenting it, and, you know, with me knowing you in real life and everything, I, I reckon it's going to, an event show of that, you know, of the size of the Oscars, basically, is going to need a co host, you know? Mm -hmm. So, I was wondering, have, have you thought about, you know, maybe a, a co host for that, you know? Yeah, I was going to get a female co host. Oh. Which rules you out. Alright, so. You know, as we know, you've been an admin for a decent amount of time, you're an admin yeah, now. Just over a year now. Just over a year as admin. Best year the forum's had, I have to add, since 2004, the glory days. But before you were an admin, obvious step was you were the moderator. Yeah. Now, when, when did you come out of power as a moderator? That was July 2006. Ooh, just, time ago. just at the start of the Club Penguin, Club Penguin era. Oh, God. Uh, Good times. I actually, I actually owe Club Penguin because if it wasn't for Club Penguin, I might not have been mod and later admin. But at the time, the forums were being overrun by spam and they needed someone to take out the trash. There we go. Exactly. Every cloud has a silver penguin shaped lining. That's, yeah. that's the moral of the story, pretty much, yeah. Basically, yeah. Pretty much. You know, and now you've been staff for four years now. Four years, man. Far too long. Far too long, man. But I need to retire and give it to you. I reckon I'd be a killer, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest, but you know, I don't think that would go down so well with, you know... I'm just joking. Oh, I'm, I'm only kidding. I that's just a pure buzz kill yeah. right there, isn't that? <laughs> but you know, obviously you're going to you love converse with all the other staff, <laughs> bitching about us all non-stop. I'm guessing my own names came up quite a bit. Uh, of course I can't... I've tried to have a look at the staff forum and it just kicked my ass every time I've tried. Private. Private. That's the definition of private, you know. Uh, but obviously you've you've built up maybe in some cases really strong, you know, bonds with the admins, you know. Yeah, actually we especially the people I worked with closely, we built up strong bonds and you know, we're really good teams at, at that time. I mean, early on 
I work constantly with RFS, dealing with Drake Drake, Drake Fowl now, I apologise. Um, dealing with Club Penguin. After he moved to the new Club Penguin forums, um, Scoots was appointed and me and him worked closely together for a long period of time. Unfortunately he's no longer on the team. But we've got we've got a new mod team as you know and we're building close ties at the moment. Uh, uh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, uh, you know, I, I love the mods. You know, especially uh, Doc yeah, right. and Doc and ACD, <laughs> as you know. Uh, but have you got, have you got a fondest, funniest memory with the staff? You know, because you've been there so long now. Uh, you mean what? What kind of memory of what? I don't know. What sort of memories we talking here? Rowdy nights out with Felicia. The <laughs> booze is pouring in. Something's gonna happen. You know, especially with her. Oh, uh, there, there, there's so many. Actually, one of the funniest moments happened and it wasn't it wasn't on the forum actually it was it was a club penguin user on MSN and I've not heard this by the way serious this is on Yeah. No. I, as as you know my, my location if you may have seen says blah 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 space station etc etc <laughs> a club penguin user on MSN asked me Hey Tetsu do you really live in a space station? Oh no <laughs> and and you know, I was just, I was like, yeah, I, I live in a space station, yeah. And I live in a pineapple under the sea. They, 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 they were believing me. I, I told Drake a file. He was like, yeah, let, let's play along to this. So we basically just took the utter rise out of this user. What the that man? For for days, just just replying back and forth, more and more lies, and they they were just swallowing. Can I say that? Just, <laughs> I don't know if swallowing's filtered. In the general context, I reckon you can get away with it here. Yes. <laughs> Sexual connotations. <laughs> oh, as you were saying. Yeah. Is we'll that the end of the story? <laughs> now, you've been a mod since 2006, yeah. but you've been a member since 2004. Mm. What, what were your early days like? Well, early in Mini, when I came to Mini Clip, um, you still look the exact same. Can I just yeah. add? <laughs> Different here though. D yeah. Shorter. Um, well, back back then, I just I remember the forum. It was obviously a lot smaller than it is now. I mean, I I actually reckon it only had about between about fifteen thousand posts at the most. But every one of them was solid gold. Only, fi only fifteen k at the most. We have members with more than that now. But Nailing yeah, time. I joined. That's when I joined the forum. And it was just. It was, a, it was a close but small community basically and said by Patrick Davy first, best believe that, cop. Yeah. And you know I wasn't really active to begin with, I sort of, I, I had other forums to go to and I sort of, so I, I basically hung around and left and hung around and left just on and off like that. Then I came back around about November and that's when I actually stayed and between, I remember that, bet yeah. between, then, between then and uh, about February, March. I was more or less the most active user on the forum. And it was like a game to get as many posts as I could every single day. Yeah, there about two thousand in two weeks. Two, two thousand, yeah, honestly. The main admin was the worst spammer on the site. Well, it wasn't actually spam. Well, I wasn't an admin back then. Just, I was just this Dragon Ball Z kid <laughs> <laughs> who sp spammed. Who spammed pretty yeah. bad, yeah. Uh, <laughs> it was funny because I, so I had about two and a half thousand posts in, in February two thousand and five. Then Amber Mouse comes along. She's like, "Right, you've spammed enough." So she she basically stops. She basically takes my posting rights away for three weeks. We can do that, by the way. That's, not, we can ooh. do. You, you can, you're not banned, but you can't post. That's bitch, it's, it's man. Really horrible. And in addition, my post count was cut from two and a half thousand down to one hundred twenty-seven. Are you kidding me? On? No, honestly, I never knew that. This is, this is just all. This is all just like. Regurgitated from my wiki page, <laughs> but it's so, like a therapy lesson. It's yeah. all coming up now, man. So you lost two thousand posts, ladies and gentlemen. So I was like, Scott. So after that, I came back and well, I, I didn't really, I hadn't really changed. No, I hadn't changed, but it was under the pretense he had, so he could get yeah. back. We all do it, you know. It was funny because well, by the end of that year, I managed to win the first member of the year competition. Did you win it first year? I won it first year. Yeah, I think I did not dodge it as all that. Did I not win one of your number of the months as well? I I'm, actually can't remember, but I'm, I'm, I'm guessing you did. Well, what, I only ever ran three, mm. I think, uh, before Intel brought it back. Thank you very yeah. much. But 
Who want no? Gimli won it. Then you won it. Then. Oh God, I think it was Kaboom. I don't know. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> back to the question. Back to. Um. So it's a bit more, more or less all of 2005 was just me spamming and getting kind of ridiculous amount of posts. 2006 Club Penguin came and I sort of. I sort of got a bit more serious, just, you know, to kind of deal a with... A bit. A bit. <laughs> to kind of try and deal with the penguins, I thought, because they were they're worse than I was. And then I became a mod somehow. Well, I say somehow. Every, <laughs> there was a few people really surprised that I became a mod, because they were like, how did how did this spam kid get to be mod? <laughs> anyone can be a mod. But, but I did, so... Well, not anyone, but yeah. So, yeah. Between then, I was at modding all through two thousand and six um, stuff, and yeah, I think that more or less covers my it, early days. It does. That is the early days, and this sort of leads on to the next question, um, because obviously you changed the person. You say you became more serious, but the forums obviously changed as well. Uh, how would you know? Would you say the forums changed? You know, what's the key changes, and do you like the change? Do you think it's changed for the better, uh, the worse? I think I think the forum is constantly changing. I mean, <laughs> I mean, can you be any more general? <laughs> Fuck sake. I will be, but you have to give me a chance to answer. <laughs> it's like you go. Uh, and you go. The, it, it feels like Miniclip was first of all, you know, hadn't basically had no rules when I came, and it was just total spam fest. But it was a very small, it was a very small forum. So I guess the spam, if you can call it that, was generated. You know, it didn't amount to much, so you know who cared. It seems like a lot, but like I've got to say, this just a wee anecdote. It seems like you know, two thousand and three and stuff. It was so much more active, yeah. But when you check it, I mean, it wasn't much. It was like twelve thousand posts in like half the year, wasn't it? It was like yeah, nothing. Really, it was nothing. Really, really nothing. I mean, I think I think in two thousand and three, two thousand three actually, you got less than ten thousand posts by the end of that year. That's far. So that's nothing. I'm sure, as I said, but every one of them was a complete gem because we had Jim B. Hello representing even then. He was, remember he was Jim B. Highland. Did he ever get his post added on? Yeah, two counts emerged. Oh, right. That Sonic Avatar's legendary, I've got to say. I remember I tried to swagger Jack him once and I just, I just got abused by everyone for stealing it. Uh, but yeah, sorry, back, back to the question. Um, the change, do you, do you, as, as you were saying basically before I interrupted you. Know? Well, yeah, it, 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 it was, you know, really relaxed then I'd, I'd say that that still remained in 2005 in 2006 was it was the penguins coming in it's funny not only did the staff become more serious and we became more focused on enforcing rules but members became more serious i mean those of you, those of you who um were there at the time will remember you know basically Lots and lots of users backseat moderating, flaming penguins. It still happens, but it's it, toned down, you know. It does. But I think in the, ser the seriousness that, that developed in 2006, it was staff and members, so you, you can't just pin it on the rules or the staff or anyone. 2007, we were kind of in a bad way there, and that, that was kind of reflected in the atmosphere of the forum. I AKA mean, none. There was about as much atmosphere and as there is on the moon, you really. Know? No. I mean, I mean, if you look at it, the penguins had left. Ninety percent of many clip had been chased away. Because All the good folk had they they just packed. they just gone because of the penguins. When no, the penguins no. left as well, there was like I don't know a dozen of us active. For the was whole it year. that little? That little? Fucking really? Hell. I mean, if you look at it now, we're, we're getting like a quarter of the posts per month that we generate now. You know, if I'm, trying, I'm trying to work out what, a, a quarter well, of the posts. Well, say, say we generate 100,000 posts a month nowadays. Do we hell? Yeah, almost. What? 100,000 a month? Well, we did one month. I'm, 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 being, a bit, I'm being a bit optimistic, but I am the admin and I have to be. <laughs> but we did, we did in August, last August, we got 100,000 posts. First time since 2006 we had done so. I take it when you did it in 2006, it was because of the penguins. Because of the penguins. <laughs> okay, well, can, can, just, just as an example. Enough about the penguins. Just, just, just as an example, right? Imagine if we got 100,000 posts each month today, okay? In 2007, we would only have got 25,000 or less a month. So less, about a quarter? A quarter, I think, like I said, a quarter of what we get now. 
you know, that, 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 that was the situation back then. But you were there, you were there through all the in the fin. I was there throughout. Wasn't really a great month for this, a great month, great year, for, great, this, yeah, great year yeah. for the staff either. Read my wiki page about that. I'm not going to bore Don't you. Don't read all of his wiki pages. Some mistruths about my good character on that page. Do no. not listen. It's lies and slander. Anyway, two, 2008 forums got a bit more optimistic and we relaxed the rules because, as you know, the group we call the Oaters came along. And. <laughs> yeah. Oaters. Oaters. Yeah, then they. Well, to be honest, they really just about saved the forum. They. Gotta give them credit when it's due, man. They got, they, they got the activity back up again, and we, you know, we, we wanted to keep them. We, we didn't want them to run off and leave, so we relaxed the rules. And the atmosphere, the whole atmosphere improved. Two thousand and nine, I became admin, and then know, shit hit the fan. Yeah, <laughs> and mini clip forums went to hell. And it was and, and that was the end. That's where it ended. And that's and that's my view in the atmosphere of mini clip. Awesome, Open awesome. Years. What about Wait a minute, wait a minute, I just need to bring shit back like the chorus right here, man. 2010, man, the, the Two, best year of all. I, I mean, I'll just tell it for the grapevine, 2010, that some really amazing members from 2004 came back and single-handedly saved the forum. What, what, is, that, is this true? Well, the cheat came back. Oh, the cheat did cut exist. Just the cheat, he's... Yeah, ju just the cheat. He's banned at the moment. He is I, banned. <laughs> That's... Ugh. We'll, 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 see if we can, we'll see if we can help him out, maybe. That's it, Josh. I did this for you, man. Honestly, great. Uh, 2000, yeah, 2010. I won't comment because the best is yet to come, as we know. As we know. As we know. All right, now, you know, we've talked the history. We've talked about you being on the mod team. Mm -hmm. do you, is it something you enjoy? Do you enjoy being staff? I do, yeah. Um, otherwise, I wouldn't do it. I, I enjoy the responsibility. You know, I like... I like working on the forum, I like trying to improve it. He likes calling the shots, he's Machiavelli. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Future dictator right there, man. So, it's, you know, it's just, I like, I like, I like banning people, giving infractions. That's, that's all the good stuff that's, in that's, life. That's, that's, why I've, that's why I've given the most out. That's true, actually, isn't it? Not, not bans, actually. That, that, that Scoots is... Um, Scoots is always going to hold that record down, <laughs> yeah. man. He did a lot in his short time, <laughs> for, for better or worse. Uh, but yeah, I've done most infractions and stuff. And I enjoyed it. Did <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So overall, it's you enjoy being staff. Absolutely. Overall, it's yeah. it's not for some people. I mean, yeah. being in staff. If you're going to be in staff, if I if I email you and say, hey, do you want to be mod? I will include in the message. By the way, you're going to have to deal with confrontational users, problems, people whining and stuff. Sometimes. You know, sometimes it gets too much for people, and they have quit in the past. Because no bad cause moment. Because be, being a moderator, it's it's not just lock thread, delete posts. A lot of shit comes with it, and people aren't aware of that. You know. Yeah. Because we we do. I, I've been guilty of this. No matter what you say about when I become a mod, I won't change. Mm. That you don't change for the job, but the job changes you. You know. Yeah. You got and, you got to change how you look at and things. And being and being admin, you know. It's, being admin, you're going to get more of the what, what I just discussed. If you're an admin, because of it, because because you're an admin, he's looking for sympathy here. That's not that bad. Well, you know, it's not it's not bad. It's not bad, but there can it can be. Is it good pay? Oh, oh wait, yeah, you don't you don't get paid. Um, being an admin obviously means you're going to get more problems and issues to deal with than being a mod because <laughs> every, everything that happens, you know, it's going to it's going to work its way up to you in the end. You know, you're the last. You're the last in the. You well, you have to deal with everything basically. That's it. It's, the shit is dropped at your doorstep, exactly. man. Let that, yeah. Yeah. If 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 a mod or someone or or a game developer doesn't, you know, if they've got a problem, they'll pass it on to the admin. Exactly. So when you work in an adoption factory, man, and someone drops off some kid with three legs and like. <laughs> Wait, stop there. Stop there. I answered the question. We, we <laughs> move, move on now. Well, you know, it's not all champagne showers and Lamborghini fleets, you know, there are downsides to being staff. You need to deal with some whiny, and I've been one of those people in my time, you know, I've had my issues with yourself, of course, but this is not at all relevant, you know. What, what do you what do you see as the downsides to the staff? You've got to take thick with the fin, but uh, what's the thick? Well, like I said before, 
downsides to being staff is <laughs> it's just having to deal with problems and issues that you know that come with the decisions that you make or your mods make and you know people aren't happy no one not no, everyone's not going to be i don't know no, you're never you're never you're never not going to have a problem as a staff member you know whatever for, form you're on because somebody's some staff is going to do something and some member is going to say hey wait i didn't deserve that or I don't like that or something. I can vouch for that, definitely. <laughs> and it's, it's going to be issues, but you know, just 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 deal with it and get it out of the way, and then you can go back to join the forum because you know staff just deal with it. Just deal with it. Just deal with it. Just deal with it. Time to time to bug off. <laughs> right, so as as you've seen, we've seen the good sides, you know, the perks, the downsides, the karma, the karma, the yin and the yang. We've seen it all right here. And uh, you know you can cop Dizzy's mixtape, man. It's on the downloads right now. Uh, but do you see yourself remaining staff for a long time? You know, do you reckon you'll eventually resign? And if you do resign, you know, who do you see replacing you? Because there's some really good uh, Scottish candidates that are like <laughs> 16 that I reckon should be considered definitely. Definitely. Um, eventually. Of, you know, eventually we'll all move on from the forum, but I don't. Know, I don't. Well, some forum. But I, I don't have any plans to resign. Now. At the moment, if and when I do, it would it would be one of the the current mods. Oh, that is such a cop out answer, man. <laughs> it would be one of the current mods that replace me. I mean, pick one, pick one. You you've been put um, on the spot. What what mod? Well, you know they're all too new to say at the moment. Oh my I mean, god! I mean, I mean, I mean, even Felicity has only been she's been staff for less than a year, so it's really. He thinks he's Switzerland with his neutral shit. Come right. on, right? Let's say F Felicia Felicia goes on a drugs binge and dies, right? Rex gets shot because okay, I, I shot him, oh, right? Okay. Who, out of the people that's left, who do you choose? Who do you choose? Uh, you've got MMF. You've got J. In fact, no, Dingy Rex. Right? I shoot JCD, right? So you've got Rex. You've got MMF. Uh, you've got who, who else mods? Uh, Jim B, Doc. Jim B, Doc. Right, how, how did I forget about Jim B? Right, so you got, you got. Realistically, right. We're only choosing people I can stand here, right? So you got MMF, Riggs, and Jim. Who's the next admin? Right here. It's been decided. Right here. He's retiring next week. <laughs> He's not got a choice. Who's, who's admin? Um, simply by virtue of him being on staff a little bit longer than the others. MMF. <laughs> Get that, get that, get that. But, you got to make but, a choice. You know, but like I said, see at this stage, it's, see at this stage, I would not. It's really too early to say. In a year, in a year's time, two years' time, you know, if we look at if we look at the candidates for admin again, then each of the mods will have done much more, and we can actually, you know, decide who, who really deserves who, who, who should be admin. Exactly. Uh, we're going to take a uh, question from the audience over here. Uh, you, sir. Oh, good day, good day, what day, praise Allah, what day, what? Oh, Intel Core 7. Alright, Subash, uh, what's your question? What day, what day, what day, what day, what day? Oh, right, ah, right, so Intel's wanting to know uh, when he can become a moderator. <laughs> <laughs> uh, answer enough. Uh. <laughs> uh, uh, we got a question from Scott Ivers right here, aka Scoots. Word big up to the Bronx, man. Uh, he's wanting to know where can he get, you know, a decent wig because <laughs> well, he, he's, well, he's sick of it. He's sick of the whole. Yeah, well, I, I, you know, I'd lend you mine, but I'm using it. Exactly, as am I. So you, you're gonna have to think outside the box, man. Okay. Nah, man. Uh, we've got one last question uh, right here for you, Colm. A worried American girl asks, is there any plans to introduce uh, bans for people who complain about hackers but are in fact hackers themselves? Is there any plans for this? Um, well, we've got a special kind of ban in development. Ooh. Which is very nasty. Sounds like a ban that could change the forum for the better, but for now, it's, uh, we're gonna we're gonna test it on ZD first. They, they are, man. I'm looking forward to that. But we're gonna have to wrap things up here. I gotta say, it's been great talking to you, man. Nice talking to you too. Thank you very much. All right, cut the video. See you later.